Hi, this is Carlo from Flybubble. I'm here with Andre from Navita, and uh, he's going to explain uh, a little bit about the UD3 and uh, some of the new features that are coming out. And, uh, the UD3 is uh, the Vario, which is an all-in-one instrument. You don't need anything else. Uh, you get a great Vario, you get a, a color, uh, sunlight readable screen, mm -hmm. uh, a touch screen, so you don't need any buttons. Uh, you get a big battery which will uh, last through, through the whole flight, even mm -hmm. if it's a very long flight. Uh, and most of all, uh, it has everything pre-installed. You can literally just show up at the launch site, uh, turn it on and you can fly. Uh, there's some new features coming out on the UD3. Uh, tell us about those. They sound yes. really great. Right. We're quite excited that we were able to uh, to uh, create an Android app which will connect to the OD, mm -hmm. uh, which means that the OD will talk to your smartphone. The smartphone will be your internet proxy, which opens the possibilities to to send your flights to cloud after you land and to make live tracking while you are flying mm -hmm. uh, with the advantage that the live tracking will not burn your phone battery because mm -hmm. it will use the GPS from the OD and it will just talk to talk to uh, the smartphone. Uh, the smartphone and OD will just talk to each other just uh, briefly every minute or so and they will burn minimum amount of battery on the smartphone. So when you land you can still call your friends to tell you're okay. Great, yeah. And uh, so how does the communication work between, is it a Bluetooth connection? It's a Bluetooth connection between the OD and the mm -hmm. smartphone, mm -hmm. uh, it, which burns very little energy. Uh, okay. And the smartphone then communicates over the cellular network or the Wi-Fi network or whatever connectivity it has. Okay, so to give us an idea, so it's, you said it uses very little battery connectivity. What sort of percentage of the battery would it use if you have a long flight? To if you have a long flight and you want to use CU Recorder to, to record your flight and to, uh, to do live tracking with the GPS on the smartphone, the phone will last between 8 and 10 hours. But with this Bluetooth connection, the phone will actually drain only as much as, uh, as if you would use it in the office. So it will easily take you through the whole day. Right, okay. Well, that's great. Okay, and yeah, one of the things that uh, I really like with the UD that I find really useful would be great to demonstrate to some pilots is how to set up uh, uh, a little task. So imagine you're, you're oh, on the yes. hill yeah. and uh, you want to set a declared goal to yeah. somewhere, uh -huh. say uh, whatever distance, and uh, show us how you do it. Oh yeah, it's very simple. You go to the tasks menu, uh, you go to the map, you zoom out enough so that you will have your task covered and then you can just click here at a waypoint, we want to fly mm -hmm. maybe up to here. Pen a waypoint, it's an 80 kilometer task, and you say, oh no, I want to fly 100 kilometers today. So you just move it until it becomes 100 kilometers, mm -hmm. and you're done. You can fly. Okay, so now, so what else do you need to do now? You just have to take off and fly the task. That's it? That's it. Brilliant. Uh, UD3 is for the paraglider pilots, and uh, now you have also the UD droplet that's coming out for the hang glider pilots. So maybe you can tell us something about that as well. That's correct. As soon as we introduced the OD3 for the paraglider pilots, the hang glider pilots were all over us. They want a device for themselves as well. Right, okay. And the more we were thinking about it, the more it made sense. And uh, so we actually created a new housing for the OD3. It's the mm -hmm. same hardware. It's mm -hmm. the same software. Uh, it includes a pitot tube mm -hmm. and it's uh, it, and it's boxed inside a housing an aerodynamic housing which works great on, on the on the speed bar of a hang glider. Well great, so that was the, the roundup of the new features for the UD3 and the UD3 droplet. So brilliant. Thanks a lot Andre. Thank great. you Carlo. Thank you.